rolled into one. So we have to keep most of our clothes on today. It's got to be kind of a little bit friendly for work. But we're gonna do a little bit of um, a little bit of magic for you guys. Maybe we'll lose a little bit of clothes at the same time, right? You know what's you know what's really cool? I just realized now in my head that every single trick today is gonna to involve someone in the audience. At least one yes, person. It is. No one yes. else has to take their clothes off except for us. It should be very mm. clear. I mean you're welcome to, but you don't have to. <laughs> yeah. Is what we're trying to say. He's looking at you, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, should we get someone to help us out? We'll do a couple of qu quick tricks and then we'll give you guys chance yeah, to ask some fantastic. questions of us. You know, I think I might, uh, the, the lady in the in the back row there, just I need to make sure first you don't work for iHeart? No, I do. Oh, you oh, do? You do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, and we'll go one step forward here, the lady with the glasses on her head. What is your name? Maybe. Mary Beth. Mary Beth. That's great. And we're in the South. <laughs> we, need to, we need to point out, we know that Americans love our accent, but please know that when we're in the South, we love your accent. And then you drop a bombshell like Mary Beth. Mary Beth. <laughs> I love it you so sound much. just like a Southern belle. Mary like Beth, it. do you have a, um, a phone? Yes. Can you do me a favor? Uh, can you can you just um, come up here really quick? Yeah, to a big okay. round of applause a from huge the, uh, the audience. Yeah. 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 yeah, Mary Beth. Hello, Mary Beth. Now, I'm gonna, I've got my phone on me uh, too. Uh, can you go to Wicket, uh, Google for me? We're going to try a trick. This is an experimental trick, and if it doesn't work, we'll just take our shirts off and you guys won't care. Be great. Um, <laughs> that's the plan there. So once you go to Google, can you type in for me... Um, how big is Christopher? No, um, how many articles are on Wikipedia? And what, what do you think, Mary Beth? Uh, do you think it's 100,000 and a million? Two million. Two million, let's have a look. Mm. In fact, uh, just go to that top website, let's go for that. And uh, I just got a match on Tinder. So, <laughs> uh, so as of today on this website, there's 5.7 million articles with an average of and that's just 1, on the English version, right? Yeah, that's the English version yeah, of Wikipedia. We do so, 5.7 million articles, 1,000 articles. Can you click visit Wikipedia there? And here's what I want you to do. I want you to see the search bar there for Wiki. I want you to um, go back to your seat and search anything, okay, in there. Don't make it Naked Magicians, that might be too And don't easy. make it something we could have found out about you by yeah. looking up your name on the list here. So just search something right now. And make sure it's random, random, okay? Yeah. And uh, tell me when you've searched it. And when the articles come up for you. Mary Beth. Oh, okay. <laughs> have, you, have you searched anything, Mary Beth? Yeah. Uh, is there an article? Yeah. Can you scroll through the article and just find a word that's big? Maybe eight, nine, or ten letters, mm -hmm. something like that. And that gets rid of the, the, what, when, why. Find a big word. Okay. So the reason we're doing this, uh, can you remember that word for me, please, Mary Beth? And put your phone away as well. Okay. That'd be so great so we can't look at it or get someone over your shoulder or anything like that. Uh, a lot of people are surprised to learn that we actually do magic and that we're not just a couple of strippers from uh, Australia. <laughs> um, so, you, okay, 5.7 million articles. If we do a card trick with you today, which we will, it'll be a little different. Um, it'll be the odds of finding your card will be 1 in 52. Uh, and it's physical, so we can touch the cards, we can manipulate them, which we do. Mm -hmm. uh, but if it's just on Wikipedia, the articles, the English version is 5.7 million Yeah, articles. one in 5.7, and each article's got like a thousand words, right? So, so it's almost like six, almost six billion different words. He's on a hot streak, yeah. you do it, you and do all it. all Wikipedia, right? <laughs> and you thought of one word, a long word. Have you still got it in your mind? Right. All right, let's narrow it down it's just a little bit here and help us out, what was the first letter your word starts with not what you searched, but the the word somewhere that you just stopped oh. with your mind and your eyes. What was oh. the first letter? O. Oh. 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 Okay. Let me try this out here. Um, was it? Uh, wait a second. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Okay. You know what uh, today is, and uh, and next week when we go uh, to perform at Deepak, it's a very special. Um, Occasion? Was it occasions? It was was that, that the word, word that, that you just stopped at? Okay, that's one yeah. thing. Wait, wait. The crowd normally goes wild at that moment. <laughs> <laughs> Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look up no, something on my phone. We didn't say anything else. Really oh, did we? Didn't say anything else in advance. Yeah, cool. I've got, I've got, uh, I've got Spotify open right now, and uh, I'm gonna get you uh, when I count down from three. I want you to say the name of what you looked up. Three, two. One. Lady Gaga. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah. That's the magic right there. <laughs> wow. 
I can't believe that shit works. Okay. Yeah, right, 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 right. okay, so look, we brought you a, a little gift. I'm going to introduce it really quick. It's uh, it's this box here. Now, before we do anything with it, um, uh, hello there, miss. What's your name? Terena. Hey, Terena. Got the drink there. Fantastic. You got right. the drink. Yeah. Um, can you just check that box out? It's a wooden box. It's it's actually locked in the front. I just need you to examine it and make sure it really is wooden, solid, and locked right now. There we go. And uh, can you just drop that into my into my pocket, please? And sorry, your name again is? Uh, thank Sharina. you. Sharina? Tarina. Tarina. Good memory, Tarina. She's still with us. That's great. If you can, uh, would you better make your way up here to the little uh, stage space to a big round of applause? Come on up here. Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this, Tarina. I've never met a Tarina before. I like it. Serena, help me out over here. Um, this is going to start like a normal card trick, yeah? So what I've got here is a is a deck of cards. Serena, I want you to check they're all different here. You can see they're all different. Yes, yes. You can talk to him a real person. Yes, they are. <laughs> yeah, 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 cool. She looks pissed off that we still have her clothes on right now. Um, right. So you can see they're different there. We'll show you a couple of cameras here at the front. Now, Serena, I'm going to get you to choose just one card out of here in a moment. Do not let me influence you, okay? Make sure it really is a fair choice. So uh, you just grab any card out there for me. Grab one out. Great. Now, I'm going to get you to sign right across the front of the card. I did bring a little Sharpie marker here for you. But rather than signing with your name, Tarina, we're going to get you to sign it with your porn star name. Yeah. <laughs> now, that's made up of two things. Everyone has a porn star name. I'm going to give you the pen here, and I want you to sign right across the front. Your porn star name is made up of your first pet name and your first street name. They go together to make your porn star name. So write your first pet name and your first street name right across the front of the card there for us. Oh, I feel like you've got a good one. Yeah. <laughs> so as an example, my porn star name would be Buffy Mountain, Buffy the Bird, and I lived on Mountain Parade. Uh, Chris, what would yours be? I'll don't do this now. All right, you don't want to. My porn star name is Puss St. Helens. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's true. All that's true. Right. Porn star name. So you write yours down. Do you want to go ahead? Yeah, yeah, that, would, that was what we were... Never mind, yeah, cool. So just <laughs> sign it right there, uh, right across the front of the card there. And once you sign it, just uh, say stop here for me. We're going to get you to bury the card back into the deck. Anytime now, Tarina. you got to say stop for me. <laughs> That's okay. Stop. It's my fault for choosing you. Don't worry about it. Place the card back on there. And we'll give it a bit of a mix in here as well. You can recap the pen as well. Yeah? You oh, you've done that already. Cool. Didn't think you'd be... Okay, ahead of me. Okay, um, okay, there you okay. are. Tell you what, I've got something kind of cool for you. Chris, hold on sure. to the deck of cards. Sure. What I've got right here, Serena, is um, is clothes that are actually about to come off. Uh, I'm going to take these off right this here. This is when it Tarina. gets fun, Serena, and you're oh, going to be yeah. a part of it. Yeah. You're going to be an all Serena vehicle today, okay? Serena, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <Trino, laughs> my, my bad, my bad. Serena, all right, check this out here. Serena, right down here. I've got something special for you in my, in my pants right here. Yeah, it's, something, it's something long. Uh, it's soft right now. It's actually this uh, bit of rope. Uh, so if I can get you to take that and uh, yeah, you pull it all the way out, pull it all the way out, gentle, and uh, take it all the way out. Faster, faster. All the way, yeah. What's at the end? There is a key. A key to your box. Yes, it's the lock right. box. So we're going to get you to uh, hold on to the box with uh, your left hand, if that's okay. So hold your left hand out like this. And because uh, I'm going to take my stuff off too. <laughs> and I want you to start by putting the key inside the box. Yeah. Okay, Pop inside in. the, uh, the opening there. Yep. And uh, turn it. It goes about uh, 45 degrees. Yeah, all the way around. Yep, that's good there. That's good, that's good. And then lift up that lid. Lift up the lid, yeah. We're yeah, not going like to touch one, it. Yeah. This is going to be all you remember. It's that same box. Yeah, you yeah. might need to turn it a little bit more. <laughs> we are yeah, going to touch it now. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Inside there is something. Show, show everyone what's inside before you take it out. Like, show them... Yeah. One folded up playing card inside the box. Now, That's really cool. <laughs> take out the card for us. And so we know it's not just any random card. Take the box. It should be your... Yes, it is. Show everybody, show everybody. And the crowd goes... Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, of course. Hey, give us a little kiss, Serena. Oh! My goodness! They warned me about Southern Girls, aren't you? Yeah. And it's your slime one. It has your um, porn star name right across the front. It is... Knuckle ridges. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm, uh, I'm not going to make these jokes about knuckle. Um, you had seen you somewhere before, that's for sure. <laughs> hey, if you, uh, you actually take that home tonight and pop it under your pillow when you go to bed, it's tomorrow morning, yeah. it'll still be there. <laughs> there we go. Give <laughs> Knuckles a big round of applause. Thanks, Knuckles. All right. Oh, that's great. That's my new favourite porn star name, I think. Yeah, so I we like should that. point out, after we do this next trick, we're going to do a bit of a Q&A with you guys. 
If you have any questions about us as entertainers, as, as normal guys, if you want to get to know the real people, people. Yeah. Yeah. Um, about our show, our travels across uh, America or the world, you'll have a chance to ask us anything you want, uh, and that'll be after this next trip. Uh, should we start by handing yeah, this out? Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's start. Actually, we actually brought a gift along for someone today right here that someone lucky can keep. Um, would, you, would you be able to help me out? You don't work for iHeartRadio, right? Me? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking right. There's no one else near you. Just get. Would you be able to give us a hand up here? Sure. Yeah, please make your way up here once again. Give her a round of applause. Make it welcome, mate. Welcome, mate. Yeah. It's Tuesday midday. <laughs> we got that drinks. We got going. naked dudes. Yeah. You haven't got a ring on. This is just getting oh, better yeah. and better and better. Come see between us. What is your name? Kim. Kim, do you have a phone with you, Kim? I nice do. Yeah. yeah. Have you got it here with you? I do. Oh no, I've left it in there. Oh, okay. Is it right there? Yeah. Can we? Would that be? Oh, Tarina's gonna grab it for us. Tarina. Thank you. Yeah. There we go. Great. Right. Yes. Oh, it's. Uh, what do you got there? Oh, okay. Does anybody have? I have no idea how. To, what is that brand? Of, it's a Moto. Oh, that'll yeah, slow us right down. Yeah. Yeah. Who's got uh, iPhones? Are easier. So. Yeah. Has anybody got an iPhone I can borrow right here? <laughs> can I borrow someone's iPhone? Here we go. Yeah. I'm gonna grip, jump out of the shit. It's, it's just because we're about oh, to do right something this. specific, and, it, and I have no idea how to use those phones. Easier. Um. So this is a gift for you. Uh, we're not gonna show you what's inside yet, but it is a rolled up poster uh can you hang on to it and in all seriousness have we said anything up beforehand or anything like that no can you take this <laughs> we're gonna get you to throw you it just, into the you audience you just got a tinder match over here as well it wasn't you was it <laughs> <laughs> so here's what we're about to do we're gonna pick some people at random uh to do that your name one more time yeah. Kim is going to throw Snuggles, our mascot, into the audience. This yeah. is so we know that we didn't, you know, find some of you in the foyer beforehand and say, hey, we're going to ask you some questions, answer it like this. This has to be very, very random because what we're about to do is going to be impossible on someone else's phone using a poster and a bunny, which is <laughs> as you do. Uh, so can you just turn around? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. you're at a weird wedding. Throw the rabbit bouquet <laughs> over your shoulders. Okay. And someone, just the nearest person, you won't need to stand up or do anything, just catch the bunny. Go for it, Kim, give it a toss. Give it a okay. yeah, There we go, okay. <laughs> someone has to read, you, okay. <laughs> then you can turn around now, Kim. Yeah, there we go. So we're gonna get you to help, we, you were just up on, on the stage space, but that's okay, you hold on to it, there's not a lot of people here. We're gonna get a few more people to help us out as well, so you, that everyone knows you're not in on it. I want you to help me out by thinking of a single digit number for me. Have you got one in your mind? We're gonna multiply it up with a few other numbers that people are gonna think of randomly in the room to get a really long number on someone else's phone that's completely random, can't be set up uh, in advance. So a single digit, what do you got? You can tell me. Eight. Eight, okay, great. What's just close here? I'm gonna press clear and eight, okay? Make sure you, you can like um, confirm for everyone doing correctly. Time, uh, eight mm -hmm. uh, times by. Now, uh, the lady next to you, can I get you to think of a two digit number and just call it out for me? Any two digits? 23. 23, what's just close? 23, we're doing that correct? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and we need a, a third person to help us out. Uh, maybe if you can throw the bunny to someone, we'll get someone completely at random. Yeah, give it a throw. Yeah, anywhere you like. Oh, you're just gonna pass it to, it's not past the bunny, okay? Uh, that's okay, lady behind you, a four digit number for me. Any four digits, out loud for us. Actually, you know what? Um, yeah, give me a four digit number, go for it. Yeah, what do you got? 1,076. 1,000, 1,000, 1,076. And multiply by one final number. I want you to key in a three digit number. Don't say what it is, three digit number, and then press equals, okay? And Chris has turned away so he can't see. Now, is the answer on the screen? Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. You can talk to me. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah? Okay. So hold on, to, <laughs> hold on to the phone there. Hold on to the phone. Great. And over to you, Chris. Don't don't let him see. Okay. okay. So Kim, the other thing is we don't want you to let the screen lock at any point. So just touch the answer with your thumb every now and then. So we've got a one-digit number by a two-digit number by a three-digit number by a four-digit. It's going to be big. Kim, yes or no? Does it end? I'm going to try and figure this out. Does it end in an eight? It does. Okay, I'm going to go. One in nine chance. So I'm going to go backwards from the end. Just say yes or no every time. So there's an eight, uh -huh. one, yeah. zero, yep. two, yep. five, yes. wow. zero. Yep. Is the first digit, it's odd, it's low, it's one. Yes. One, zero, five, two. <laughs> Zero one eight. Is that the oh, answer? Yes. Oh well, let's <laughs> see that. Those are completely random. You can the last uh, three digit number. You press equals. Uh -huh. So on someone else's phone, completely random. <laughs> one million five fifty two thousand and eighteen. Yes, yeah. the answer. Wow. Yeah. So that's one thing. Yeah. But we made a prediction, didn't we, Mike? We did. We gave you a gift at the start of this trick. You're still holding on to that rolled up uh, poster. If you can unroll that poster now, take your old band off. Oh, the suspense is killing me. And uh, show everybody what it has written right there. Yeah. 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 One million five hundred and 
Exactly in 52,018, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. It exactly matches your randomly calculated That's answer. Amazing. But, <laughs> thing. Do you guys know what the date is that we will be performing at DPACT on Friday, next Friday night? It is the uh, 10th month, October oh the 5th, 2018. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, how good is that? Oh, great, thank you. Is that your birthday? Oh, happy birthday. It's, uh, Man, let's give Kim a big round of applause yeah. again. Yeah. Thank you so go. much. That's for you. And we want you to keep that as well as a little souvenir. Yeah. <laughs> so that's just a couple of quick tricks, you know, with our most of our clothes on. None of those are in the show, of course. We do kind of a bit bigger stuff. But we wanted to uh, show you guys a bit of magic today. And I uh, understand you guys will be coming to the show as well, right? One night yes. next week? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Great. Super excited about that, I can tell. Um, <laughs> yes. So, yes. Like, yeah, yeah. yes, we will. Yeah, so uh, did you guys have any questions about us or the show or anything like that before we get some uh, sexy, sexy photos up here? What inspired Naked Magicians? How did it all start? Yeah, it's a good, uh, well, we were clothed magicians first. Uh, I had, uh, yeah, that's a, we weren't like the guys that did the streaking, uh, you weren't streakers at the, at the parties, um, or the nudie runs, what we call it back, back down under. Um, so yeah, we had our own shows and we wanted to uh, create something that hadn't been done before in magic. And we wanted to take magic to an audience that wouldn't normally attend a magic oh, show. Yeah. So we're like, what better way to do that than do magic with our sleeves up and pants down, right? And so together as two best mates, we designed the show. And uh, you've been touring it around the world pretty much non-stop since uh, 2014 now. So what started as a fun idea, and that's all it yeah. was, we, our only goal was to have fun with something as magicians, uh, has played, it's like 250 cities around the world, about 600 oh, yeah. shows. It's yeah. been uh, the craziest experience of our lives, yeah. yeah. It's always I, been us too, we don't have like another cast or anything, it's just, it's just us that have been touring all around the world, mm -hmm. so. Were you friends before? I, I mean, fucking I hate this guy. <laughs> 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 you just decided to team up, or were you good friends before, and had a lot of respect for each other? Yeah, we're best friends, no respect for each other. But, um, <laughs> That's why we're best friends. Yeah. I, I think uh, we were both, like, this was we, like Mike said, we were both regular magicians and we respected each other as performers individually. Uh, and one of the things, did anyone see the show last year by chance? One, two, three, three of you. Okay. Yeah. The rest of you will see when you see the show next week. Uh, it's a lot of fun. But the fun that we're having on stage is actually two best mates just having an absolute blast. Because um, yeah. we made this, like, it, we didn't want to be famous. We didn't want to tour the world with it. That was yeah. never our goal. Our goal was to just do something that we would both love. And we still love it now. So every night when we get on stage, all the laughter, all the fun, all the jokes we're, we're throwing at one another is all real. And, it's, yeah. and that's one of the things that we think makes the show enjoyable. Not just for us to do 600 times on repeat, but for the <laughs> audience to watch every single yeah. night. Yeah, so it really does help that we're friends. Definitely does, especially when we're like 16 hour days on the road yeah. and uh, then you have to do a show that night. It definitely helps when, uh, you know when girls at a club, like a guy comes up, <laughs> this is my new it's analogy. So weird. But it's like a girl, you say, yeah. okay. so like two girls are at a club and a guy comes up and then the girls look at each other and they don't say any words, but they're like, and that's like a full conversation. Yeah. We have so that now. We yeah. have that as like two best friends. Yeah. When a guy comes up to us at a club. <laughs> but like we know each other so well. We spent so much time together. We've been through the best experiences imaginable. We've had some of the hardest days ever on the road as well. And everything in between. So it, it like I wouldn't want to share that with anyone else. Yet. And no one sees me naked as much as he does. So um, yeah, it's yeah. weird. That's the weird part. Yeah. Yeah. Has there ever been a hat slip where you're like, oh dude, my bad. <laughs> oh, uh, you oh the have top hats. Hat in front of you. Yeah. Yeah, if you haven't seen the show, um, during parts of the show we have a top hat. Instead of covering this head, it's covering this head. And uh, we've got to kind of keep it there. But um, there has been a moment when someone's dropped the hat. This happened a few times um, over the last 600 and something shows. Um, it happened in Georgia, I think, right? That was the funniest thing. It happened in Atlanta, <laughs> Georgia. And we're not like, uh, like uh, we're Atlanta, going to that. Uh, yeah, somewhere. Yeah. Well, I was going to say, oh, Georgia is the town, right? No, no, so no. sorry. <laughs> we were somewhere. in Georgia. So we've been to like 120 US cities and it's a bit of a muddle in our head. Uh, but the lady was like a, a robust um, African-American lady. Yeah. And she, I had a top hat covering my penis and she had her hand, the gig, the gag was she had to keep her hand there no matter what happens in the show for like five minutes of the show. And uh, that's what she's got to keep a hand like this. And this hand had a, a prop in it that she's got to hold. 
and then I did something magical, and she goes, Oh my god! And she put both hands up like this, and then the hat just dropped. And my dong is just like swinging in the wind. Uh, that's a 100% true story. There were like 700 people in the audience. Yeah. If you want to know what it looks like down there, just ask anyone in, uh, in Georgia. Georgia. Yeah, yeah, they've seen it. The state or the city. Who knows? I don't know where it was. Atlanta's the state, the city's Georgia. No, Atlanta's definitely the city. <laughs> You're right. You're absolutely right. Okay, what he said. Yes. Yeah. I, yeah. Anyway, doesn't Thanks matter. It's somewhere in America. Is. Georgia. Yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Now, where do you stay when you're traveling? Oh, really? Okay. Oh, okay. That's personal. Where is he? You should be in 3D. Yeah, that's my room number. You'll be there. All right. Airbnb the last time in Durham. How do you even know that? It was like a year and a half ago. You remember where we stayed? You guys are naked in front of me. I didn't forget. It's getting awkward real quick. It's like a big first date. It's why I got one lined up, apparently, according to the notification on my phone. We're staying near Deepak. No one really cares where we're staying. Well, some people probably do. Unless you do, and then uh, we're we're more hotels now than yeah. for the most part. Uh, just because I think we kind of just need to have, some have, some, have a couple of hours away from each other. Yeah. It was yeah. good at the time to do Airbnbs because we could cook and we could yeah. do washing, and then uh, but then we're we're doing like nine ten months a year at the moment uh, on the road, so it's nice to have a hotel and uh, in downtown. Yeah, yeah. Because you no, I can't say it. On <laughs> no, <me. laughs> Safe word. I can't Safe talk word. about your favorite pastime. Um, does do we have any other questions? From the group here, though. Say again. What part of Australia? Oh, we're both uh, Brizzy boys, Brisbane, which is on the east coast. Um, it's like near the Gold Coast and all that. It's in between the Great Barrier Reef and Sydney, smack bang in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Brisbane. Yeah. Have you been? No, my ex was from Sydney, though. Oh, do you want us to mess yeah. him up? <laughs> yeah. 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 Don't you go? Okay. Let's cool. do a little video for him later. Yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> is he here now or is he back in Sydney? Uh, he's in Boston. He's in Boston now. We were just there last week. Maybe it's our idea. Maybe. Uh, <laughs> maybe. Um, cool. Well, look, what we'll do, we'll uh, get the rest of our clothes off and we'll do some naughty photos with you guys. And we want to thank you for uh, coming along today. And we hope you guys enjoy the show on Friday the 5th or Saturday the 6th. I'm not sure which night you guys are coming, but it's going to be fun. Well, thank you to iHeartMedia for having us back. They were the first station to ever have us uh, when we came to uh, Durham for the first time ever, and we're always so thankful for people, outlets, that get behind us when we're a new show in town, because it is a bit risky for them to take on a show like ours. Uh, and when we do the photos, we'll, we'll get someone uh, from iHeart to take them, but they'll be on your phones, okay? And the only thing that we would ask is just share the shit out of it. Put it on your Facebook, your Instagram, because we want people to know we're coming to town, because that's what we're doing. For two nights, we're coming. Okay? And, uh, so we oh, thank you for letting us show stop. you a bit of our magic. I thought we'd stop the performance. Then. Nah. Yeah, then, then, then. So guys, thank you very much. We'll be back out naked in like one minute. I'm Christopher Wayne. I'm Mike Tyler. Together we are... The Naked Hamilton. Magician. Uh, hey! <laughs> <laughs>